Simply the best college basketball player in the nation, Blake Griffin, coming off a concussion last Saturday, playing his first game since Oklahoma had lost two straight since Griffin went down. Facing Texas Tech, last time Griffin played the Red Raiders, 40 points, 23 rebounds, getting physical early on the break. He's fouled hard, goes down, he would stay in the game. Then Griffin, up for the rebound, gets raked across the face. One more look, this is going to leave a mark. Corbin Ray drawing blood. Griffin would return. Bloody nose, though. Second half still going full throttle as Griffin. Loose ball and heads up. There's a scorer's table there. Whoa! Are you kidding me? What an effort. Blake's reaction to the play going over. Yeah, I mean, I feel fine. I feel back to normal. So, I mean, I really didn't even think twice about it. Blake, everyone, and I mean everyone, took notice of the effort, including Big Brother Taylor. I couldn't really see how he landed when he threw over the, the side, so, you know, I got over there as, as soon as I could, and, you know, he kind of had that, that pissed off look in his face, so I knew, I knew he was all right. There's no quitting Blake Griffin. He doesn't care what the situation is. He'll dive on a loose ball. He'll go after it no matter where it is to let his teammates know this is how we win at Oklahoma. And yeah, he can get double-doubles, but more importantly, he knows how to get the mindset. The mindset. After a concussion, you kidding me? Go after that one. Blake Griffin, that's what I'm talking about, young fella. That's what we like to see from a player of the year candidate and from a guy that potentially could go number one in the NBA draft. I know Coach Jeff Capel probably cringed when he saw it, but the fans in the NBA, we love to see that. You saw when he jumped over the scorer's table how quickly I got down there. Um, you know, hoping that he's okay, but that, that tells you a lot about that kid. He only knows one way to play. We always worry about concussions, uh, particularly a second event can have a, a more profound uh, effect on their their cognitive or thinking. But obviously he's fully cleared and playing without any problem at this point. There are plays that make statements, statements that you want to win more than anybody else in the field or on the court. That's what Blake Griffith just did right there. Shades of Derek Jeter diving into Yankee Stadium stands. Anytime you see a teammate just do something absolutely unbelievable, it fires the whole team up, you say, Gosh, if that guy's giving it up like that, if that guy's playing that way, if that guy's punching people in the mouth, I have to because I'm going to look silly on film on Monday. I think we covered the play completely. If you're an analyst, turn the cell phone off. <laughs> Something like that happened. Griffin also making an impact on the boards, the putback there. He had 19, and then look at him drawing the triple team. How about Griffin's night? 20 points, 19 rebounds, 78-63 the final. He's back.